Slipped capital femoral apophysis is actually a misnomer. As seen in this image, the femoral apophysis is located in the normal position within the acetabulum. The pathology, in fact, usually involves slippage of the femoral head at the metaphysis. Focusing on the proximal femur distal to the growth plate, we could see that the femoral neck is displaced superiorly. This in turn makes the epiphysis look like it has slipped inferiorly. The slippage in this case is not that obvious for the untrained eye. Compare it with the plain radiograph of a normal hip on the right. To help detect the abnormality, a line referred to as Klein's line is drawn along the superior edge of the femoral neck. If the hip is without pathology, the line will pass through a portion of the femoral head. A line that does not intersect the femoral head or a line that only passes along the superior edge is indicative of slipped capital femoral epiphysis. This finding is referred to as Chertoin sign. In more advanced cases, the abnormality is easier to detect and is often likened to a scoop of ice cream falling off an ice cream cone. And really, it does kind of look like that. I recommend that you search the web for some x-rays so that you can see it for yourself.